1867, in a part of Wisconsin called the Big Woods. I lived in many places during my lifetime, including Kansas, Wyoming, Montana, and the Dakota Territory. I lived in many types of houses. The houses ranged from dugouts, which were basically dirt caves carved into the side of a hill, to log houses, a lot like this one. Life on the prairie was difficult. We had to farm the land for food and money. Once there was a massive grasshopper attack, and we lost our entire crop. There was also dangerous prairie fires that threatened our houses and crops. But probably the most dangerous time for my family was the winter of the big storm. It snowed so much that only the rooftops of houses could be seen. During that winter, we were stuck inside for seven months. We nearly ran out of food. That was a very scary time. I also had three sisters, Mary, Carrie, and Grace. Many people don't know that I had a brother, too. His name was Charles, but he died when he was just 12 days old. One year, my sister Mary became very ill. The sickness made her blind. She needed to go to a special school for the blind, but the school was very expensive. So I decided to quit school and become a teacher at the age of 15 to help pay for Mary's school. I taught in a one-room schoolhouse. Soon, I met the love of my life, Almanza Wilder. We married and had a beautiful girl named Rose. As Rose grew, I told her stories of my childhood. Rose encouraged me to write my stories down. I wrote seven books in all. I died on February 7th, 1957, just a few days after my 90th birthday. My books and stories have remained very popular even to this day.